Hey guys, what's up? Uh, we're about to do another video. Today is going to be event 5 of the Great Marble Championship. And let's just okay, get so right into it. What's going to happen is I'm going to put two marbles in the top right there, as you can see. And then we're going to go down all this, come all the way down. And then eventually, after it goes through all that, funnel into this, go into that purple one right there, funnel into this funnel, and then I'll go into this funnel. Come down, follow that one, and then I'll go to the splitter, the swervies, a yellow swervy, a little split up there, let's go up there again, a zigzag, another little swervy path, and it'll come down in this little thing that spins, and it'll <clears throat> go down into another splitter, into a zigzag path, and end up there. Whichever one wins, we'll move on, and then there will be a th three marbles that will compete a in a timed course. To see who wins it all. So here are your contestants. Orange and clear orange. Blue and orange and green. And blue and clear. They're the first two competing. And they're going to go in the funnels in three, two, one. Sorry about that. And now through the funnel. Looks like your in the lead is orange, I'm pretty sure. And yes, it is. It's a pretty good one too. Let's log into these curvy paths. And it looks like orange and clear orange, sorry. I got stuck up there, I'm gonna help him. Now with the huge lead is orange. Clear orange is way far behind. Here's clear orange and still on his Going and going and going. Looks like orange is now in this purple color. As clear orange now just gets into this blue one. And orange is gonna get into the red one now. As clear orange gets into the purple one. It's gonna be a pretty, uh, this won't be the closest race, I'm going to tell you that, but it could be a good one. But now Clear Orange gets into that red one as Orange gets into that purple one. Will Clear Orange get a little bit of ground? Yes. But clear Orange isn't going to get that far on number four. Orange gets into the red splitter. Orange is going to go on that furry path. And then Clear Orange is still in that purple one, and now get into the splitter. Orange is now into a, a zigzag path, into a furry path. And now into the splitter. And there is Clear Orange, as you see, now that zigzag path. As well as orange, but orange is going to win it. And blue orange, sadly, is going to slowly make his way to. Here sorry. is blue and orange and green. Sorry about this, but uh, yes, here's blue and orange and green. Going to go in the funnel in three, two, one. Good. Looks like your winner right now is orange and blue. Yes, Orange Blue is in the lead, coming down into these paths, but the green is going to catch up very quickly there. Now the lead is not much for Orange and Blue. Now Orange and Blue is going to gain his lead more and more, both in the, the blue funnel now. This is where it could get interesting, folks, and it looks like Green's going to take the lead. Orange and Blue right there behind him, though. Could, have or could Orange and Blue have taken that lead there, though? Now it looks like Green's going to get in that red funnel first, as Orange and Blue now gets into that red funnel as well. Green is still in the lead and going to that purple funnel. Green looks to have a pretty good lead now, and Orange and Blue now gets in that purple funnel, but uh, now it's going to be when Green gets into that red splitter into the curvy path. Orange Blue's just going to get into that red splitter. Green now into the zigzag paths as Orange Blue gets into that red splitter. Green is now into the final splitter, and it looks like Green's going to get stuck a little bit there. Could Orange and Blue nudge him? Oh yes, but Orange and Blue's going to take the lead at the last second, and Orange and Blue's going to win it. What an exciting Here race. is Blue and Clear. We're going to go into the finals in 3, 2, 1. Okay, now battling out in this final, your leader is going to be Blue. Yes, right now Blue is the leader. Not a huge lead on clear though. Clear could still make up the ground. Going back and forth down to these curved paths. This is where clear could really make up some ground. Now going to these straight paths, back and forth, battling for the lead. But blue's actually going to gain some lead, it looks like here. But no, clear's going to get into a pretty close battle with blue. Could clear take the lead here? No, and blue's still going to have the lead in this purple funnel. Looks like clear could actually take the lead here, maybe. But we'll have to see. And yes, Clear does take the lead just for a little bit, though. We have to see who continues to have the lead on this red funnel. And it's going to be Clear into this purple funnel now. Oh, 
it looks like Blue got a little bit of a hit there. Could Blue take the lead? Let's have to see when they get into this red splitter. And yes, Blue takes the lead. He's going to get into this yellow turkey pack now, into this purple splitter. Blue now into this red splitter, going into this green zigzag as Clear now gets into this red splitter. Blue now going to this shoot. And it looks like Blue's going to have it. Yes, and Blue's going to get into this zigzag and win as Clear slowly makes his way to the finish line. Okay, so what's going to happen now is Blue, Blue and Orange, and Orange, your three that have won those races, are going to get timed down this entire course. So all of them at least get 10 points. If, uh, say, we get Orange and Blue getting down at the slowest time, they'll get 10 points. Blue getting down the second fastest time, they'll get 20 points. And then if Orange gets down the fastest time, he'll get 30 points. So I'm going to time Blue first with my stopwatch here. So get up here. Blue is going to start in three, two, one. Looks like Blue is going to get through this green funnel in about, I'll have to see how many seconds it ends. It looks to be about eight seconds through that green funnel. Going down this path. Now going back and forth here. Blue is currently at 20 seconds in three, two, one. Yes, now Blue is at uh, 20 seconds going down these straight paths. About to make his way to this blue funnel. And yes, now into the blue funnel. He is at 30 seconds now. I'll have to see how close. Yes, now he's in 33 seconds. I'll have to see how fast he can get through this purple funnel. And now he is at 42 seconds now into this red funnel. Now I'll have to see how fast he can go through this red funnel into this purple one, which is going to take most of his time. Now he's at 50 seconds. This is where he, time really matters in these funnels. He has to go fast here if he wants to get a pretty good time. Now into this red splitter at one minute exactly into this sorry yellow uh, twisted path. Now into this red splitter. He's going to get stuck up there. He's going to help him a little bit. Hopefully that doesn't matter on his time too much. Now into this shoot with a minute and 15 seconds now into this zigzag. And Blue is going to get a time of... One minute and 20 seconds. Okay, orange is next. We're gonna time him down this course. Okay, we're gonna follow three, two, one. There they go. And it looks like orange is gonna get go to the funnel in about seven seconds. Now he is going down here and when he goes back and forth, and now he is at 15 seconds. Going through these curvy paths into this swervy path, about to start the long trail of straight paths. He's about to get 30 seconds, and then he's about to get in the blue funnel with 27 seconds on the clock while he's in the blue funnel. He's about to get into this purple funnel, and he's at 33 seconds. Let's see how quickly he can get into this red funnel, which is where these funnels are where you can really make up some time or ruin yourself. Now into this red funnel with 43 seconds on the clock. Could he get, the, like I said, funnels are where it gets really tricky. So, he gets in this purple funnel with 52 seconds on the clock. Hopefully he gets in this red splitter within a minute. And no, he's going to be at a minute right, right about now. Into this red splitter with a minute and four seconds. Into this other red splitter with a minute and nine seconds. What was the other guy? Into this split. Blue was uh, 1 minute and 20 seconds, so this could be a pretty close race. He is now at 1 minute and 19 seconds. 1 minute and 22, 1 minute and 22 seconds. So, let's see how uh, Orange and Blue does. Okay. Last one is Orange and Blue. Let's see how fast he goes down this. He's going to start in 3, 2, 1. <coughs> Get it into... <coughs> Finishing the screen funnel in about seven seconds. Coming down into the ceiling and going back and forth now with 14 seconds on the clock into these curved paths, into this twisty path, now into the long uh, path of straight lines. He's gonna get into this blue funnel with 26 seconds on the clock. He's doing pretty good here. Pretty well. Pretty well. Same thing. Well, now he's at. 35 seconds right now into this, into this red funnel with 40 seconds on the clock. So now 
I, like I said before, these funnels could make or break your uh, day. So, now into this purple funnel with 50 seconds on the clock. It's going to be a close race for uh, to beat orange, or maybe even blue, into this red splitter with about a minute on the clock. He's going pretty fast here. Into this purple splitter with a minute and three seconds. Now he's going to get into this zigzag with a minute and seven seconds on the clock. Now into the shoot, into this uh, purple splitter, into the zigzag, and he's going to get a time of a minute and 17 seconds. That is a record, so looks like orange and blue will get first, blue will get second, and orange will get 10 points. So you know, the winner of this video was orange and blue, then blue, and then orange.